Okay, let's talk about being a manager. It's, you know, everybody thinks about it as a promotion, but you say that it's not quite a promotion. Yeah, I said it's a, um, it's, it's, people think it's a promotion. I think it's a career change. And the reason why, I think that's, there's actually an image at the top of the handbook. Uh, I think it's uh, me, someone typing into Quora or the internet going, you know, how, how do I, how can I be a technical manager of teams or something? It was like, what the hell, like WTF, what am I doing? The emotional response I wanted to get out of using the word career change is, I think that's the, the, the way you've got to lean into the new job. You know, um, and, but just think about this in like a context of how we all learned, like we, we became into uh, the, the roles that we had right in tech companies is, you know, you go to school, you learn all the science you're supposed to learn. Maybe you're lucky and took a sociology class of which I did not take. You go to university and you're so focused on trying to make things work, right? You're just focused on like, you know, um, like building things, learning how to program, learning how to write well, you're, you're doing assignments. like. I, I had no classes on how do humans work, right? Like I did not take enough human sciences. I did not take enough biology about how the brain works. Like I was terribly equipped for leadership. Um, and mostly just be like, again, I, I wasn't taking my fault. Like as a, as a society, it's not like we, we train people to be good leaders, right? We train people to know math and study and memorize. But um, like I would actually throw out most of the education c curriculum and actually um, – change things. I think there's a lot about how humans work that I was duly equipped. So for me, as a career change is like, listen, you're, you're kind of leaning humans now and humans are this weird thing, right? <laughs> like we're this unfinished biological thing that you kind of had to understand how humans work. And I know that most of you have not studied it because our education system does not force us to study humans when we probably should. Um, and I think that was, I think important for me to invoke because I, in, during my own journey is, is, you know, as I stumbled, you know, screwed up, a lot of it was by my lack of kind of spending time studying and re like taking my own, like having to build my own curriculum of, of how people, how humans work and how we communicate languages, cultures, um, how to get shit done. Right. Um, and that's, that, that's what I was trying to evoke there. And that's, that, that's, I mean, at some point maybe people will read this, but that was the, the, how I wanted to start it. So people would get into the mindset, right. I'm going, cool. I've got to relearn and learn new stuff. And it's not that you, you know, people were bad, like people are inherently bad at it. It's just, no one's taught everyone any of this. Right. And, yeah. and, and some people were by osmosis. were really good at picking it up. But if you, if you look at, if you look at how much time we spend teaching people about other things, like this is like 0.1% of what we teach people, right. Before we end up in these jobs. So.